Dan here with Oklahoma Joe's, and welcome to the detailed breakdown of our Highland Offset Smoker. So the Highland is actually the smaller of our two offset smoker sizes, coming in at 57 inches long, 33 and a half inches deep, and 53 inches tall at the smokestack. The two major cooking components, the firebox and the smoke chamber, are going to be made of a two and a half millimeter cold rolled steel, and it's all going to be coated in a high temp paint. The entire package is going to come in weighing 178 pounds. Moving on to some details, let's take a look at the firebox. You're going to get a 17 inch diameter barrel, 16 inch in length. Some of the exterior features here, we have our plate warmer. It's actually going to absorb a lot of the heat coming off that firebox and create a nice warm surface. You can set things there for prep, or if you're pulling stuff off the smoker that you want to keep warm, this is a good spot for it. Guys also like to actually take logs and put them here to kind of preheat them and get them ready to put into the fire. On the front, you'll see our cool touch handle. The spring actually insulates the handle from the fire in the firebox. Uh, makes it easy to grab without worrying about a burn. Looking inside, you're going to see two porcelain coated grates. The six millimeter wire. It's a nice robust cooking surface. The porcelain coating makes it super easy to clean. Uh, so it's a great cooking surface should you choose to use this section as a charcoal grill. And in that case, you get 260 square inches of cooking space in this chamber. Below that, you're going to see our fire grates, and that's where you're going to build your fire, whether you're using this for a charcoal grill or you're using it to heat the smoke chamber. Moving on to the side, you're going to see our air damper and access door. The air damper here, of course, is going to regulate the air that's flowing to the fire, opening it up to increase that flow and increase the temperature in the smoke chamber, closing it off to choke off that fire and lower your temperature. Opening up the ash door, you'll see a, a nice generous access to the fire and the ashes that are produced in there. So you can uh, come in here after your cook and clean it out that way, or sometimes what will happen in longer cooks, your ash will build up and you'll need to kind of clean that out with a tool uh, to, to get that airflow back and, get, and have your control over the fire. Moving on to the smoke chamber, starting with some of the exterior features on the smoke chamber, you're going to see a nice high quality temp gauge. This is going to give you a reading of the air temperature at the gauge. Across, uh, across the lid, you're going to see a secondary plug. So what that allows you to do is change the position of the temp gauge or add an additional temp gauge to get a reading across the entire smoke chamber. The handle, we have the same cool touch handle that's on the firebox. In front here, a nice generous expanded metal shelf. It's a good spot to bring, uh, again, if you're prepping food or bringing or pulling things off the smoker when they're done, nice big work surface to have there. On the side, uh, our smokestack with air damper. So you're going to use this air damper in conjunction with the air damper on the firebox to control the flow of air. Again, closing it off to choke out the fire and bring the temperature down, or opening them up to increase that airflow and increase the temperature inside the smoke chamber. Then we also have a carry handle here with the firebox acting as a counterweight. Makes it nice and easy and maneuverable to move, kind of relieve some of that weight. So looking inside, first thing you're going to see, three porcelain coated grates, six millimeter wire, nice and robust porcelain coating, easy to clean just like in the firebox. And across these three grates, you're going to get 620 square inches of cooking space. Below that, you're going to see two fire grates, which allows you to use this entire smoke chamber as a charcoal grill as well, if you should choose to. Uh, that would give you a total of 880 square inches of total cooking space if you're using both the firebox and the smoke chamber uh, as a charcoal grill. Moving on to the cart, nice robust two inch tube legs, uh, a large expanded metal shelf, so that's great for storing charcoal or extra logs or any fuel like that. Uh, and then of course we have our 10 inch wagon style wheels which really complete the look of our Oklahoma Joe's product. And that is the detailed breakdown of our Highland Smoker. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, visit OklahomaJoe's.com for more information on this smoker, uh, where to buy, and information on the other smokers that we offer. I appreciate you watching. Thank you.